Hey everybody, Hatcher here with gaming news, reviews, and tips. GNRT, and we're back in DCS World looking at VR settings, and today we're taking a closer look at MSAA, multi-sample anti-aliasing. So this setting reduces jagged lines on the edges of objects, and it should be quite computer taxing, and I would think it should change our visuals quite a bit. When it comes to MSAA in DCS World, we have three settings to choose from, off, two times, and four times. So we're going to do a side-by-side -side comparison with the two extreme settings, off and four times, and see how this affects performance and game visualizations. Now normally when I do these side-by-side -side comparisons, I use a multiplayer server, but in the interest of time, I thought it was more efficient for me to use the instant action and the mission settings. Now I thought I would notice the most difference on the aircraft carrier or in the cockpit. So you can see here we start off in the cockpit on the aircraft carrier, not that much difference within the cockpit. And even when you look out onto the, you know, the long lines of the aircraft carrier, not that much difference in that jaggedness and that jagged feel. Um, you know, when you change the setting, you're from, from off to four times, you're not getting a lot of bang for your buck. Uh, same thing is true. I, I also did this uh, on land in the airport, take off and then in the air and uh, tried to compare the visualizations there and the graphics there and really no appreciable difference in the cockpit in the air again you have to think that this is an air combat game and so you're not seeing a lot of uh, different terrain lines or anything like that most of it is in the cockpit so for me i did not notice much of a difference in gameplay or in uh, the visualizations and in the graphics between off and between four times Really, the, the biggest thing that I noticed, it, there was a bit of an, a performance effect, but it wasn't all that serious. And I noticed it mostly when I was flying into highly intensive areas like a city. Um, there was a, a little bit of a drop in the frame rate, but it really was not that drastic for, for the most part. No difference on the aircraft carrier, no difference uh, in the air and in other scenarios. Anyway, I hope this video has helped you out. Again, for me, I will probably continue to play uh, with MSAA off because it really does nothing for me and it might decrease my uh, performance a little bit. And so for me, since the cockpit looks the same and everything else uh, is pretty much the same, I'm going to be playing with it off. That's how I've played historically. Um, and then, uh, so that would be my recommendation to you folks out there. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, give me a like, subscribe, or leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you'd like to see or things done differently. And we hope to see you in-game.